know you don't need me to tell you that the Internet has been kind of a double-edged sword. That's true in every area of life, including investing. I mean, sure, the web makes everything more convenient, right? You have all sorts of information available at the push of a button in your fingertips, something that was unimaginable when I got started in this business. It was much harder to do the homework in the old days. It took real effort. These days, everything is searchable. Hey, and then there's ChatGPT. So the Internet's great for investing, but it also creates tons of new problems. And when we have new problems, we need new rules to help contain them. For example, you absolutely have to be able to explain your stock picks to another human being. If you can't explain it, you don't understand the story well enough to justify buying the stock in question, right? Here's the thing. In the old days, this rarely came up. But the rise of the Internet took away one of the most important breaks in the process, one of the most important warning systems, which is talking to another human being about what you want to buy. It used to be that you had to talk to a broker to buy anything. Now, with the stroke of a key, you can buy the stock of Skyworks Solutions or an Albemarle without ever having to tell another person why you're doing it, that it's cell phone, that it's uh, lithium. I mean, so in even that, you don't have to even pay a commission. To me, I'd much rather have the commission and some a real person. But it might not happen. Why is this an issue? Why do you need to explain this stuff to someone, to anyone else? It doesn't have to be a professional, by the way. It could be anybody, preferably an adult. But you can fall back on explaining to your kids if you can't find an adult who's willing to listen to you babble about the market. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at CNBC.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com.